Hey everyone, welcome to your beauty network and today we're going to be doing this video on how to do eyebrows. This video is made for uh, guys if you have a boyfriend and you're doing his eyebrows or if uh, you have a husband or any masculine eyebrow that you want to be doing. Uh, this video is going to be covering that. I had a question or a comment posted by a viewer. Uh, his name is Sondri. I don't know how you say this, Sonri, S-U-D-L-A, he's from Mexico, uh, so he likes my eyebrows, he said, he posted a comment on the other how-to video on eyebrows, um, and he wanted to know, you know, he said he liked my eyebrows and he wanted to know um, how could he do his eyebrows, you know, more, more masculine eyebrow, so what I did was let my eyebrows go in for about three weeks now, uh, I can't take it anymore, so <laughs> we're going to do this video now. So the tools you're going to need for this video um, to do masculine eyebrows are basically just your tweezers. These are a tweezerman eyebrow or tweezerman um, tweezers. And so we're going to go ahead and get started. I would most likely start your masculine. Remember, this is a masculine video, meaning um, this is for guys' eyebrows, um, which are kind of very basic. So what we're going to do is just we would clean up, um, you know, in between here, and you want to take it about the center of right in here, your nostril, straight up and straight up right in there. So we would just tweeze any hairs that are in between. And you can see that I don't have, you know, really anything in between to tweeze. So we're just going to clean up all that in there. And it looks like there's whatever is there we're going to clean up. That would be your first step, um, guys. Once again, this is if you are a guy and you're tweezing your own eyebrows or if this, you're a girlfriend, wife, whatever, and you're looking to do your husband or boyfriend's or masculine eyebrow. So once you've cleaned up all that center section, we're going to move on to this eyebrow. What you want to do is just take a straight line from uh, the outer edge of the eyebrow straight across into the inner in here. So you can see that I have some in there. And you're basically just going to tweeze um, whatever hairs you have there. I let my eyebrows grow about um, <laughs> about three weeks now, and um, I was gonna kind of let them grow in more, but I just can't take it anymore. And I need to I need to do them. <laughs> so once you got um, pretty much a, a line straight across, that'll be pretty much as much cleaning as you need to do. I think I have some hairs down here, so let me continue with the hairs down here. And um, so once you've pretty much got all that section cleaned up, um, so now that you've got all that section cleaned up, remember kind of a straight line across from the outer edge of the eyebrow, straight into here, once you've got a straight line like that, and you're pretty much basically cleaned up for that. Um, and now what you want to do is just naturally the arch would be wherever the arch is at, you just want to clean whatever is um, not really, like it needs to be cleaned up. Remember you, you want to keep the, so the um, shape more masculine, so you want to think more squareness like, you know, um, with the brow and um, and not really take it up into an arch, just kind of make it go straight across more more like. But um, you know, if the arch was like say right in here, this would be the high point of the arch naturally. I would probably just tweeze whatever's, you know, keep in mind this line here, I would just tweeze whatever's slightly within this area. I wouldn't um, start taking it up into the, you know, high up into the arch and start cleaning that in like you kind of would for a feminine eyebrow. So um, pretty much for the masculine eyebrow here, what I have is just some hair in here. Um, we're just going to take out a couple more now, right, right in this section. This is where the natural arch would be. And um, yeah, so we're just going to clean up those a little bit. And you see that um, this would be, you know, if it was more of a masculine eyebrow, there would still be more hairs in here, but since I didn't grow out completely, there's not. This would be the masculine hairs right here, so I'm not tweezing that out. And um, these these hairs here would be um, also the masculine shape there. Uh, a lot of guys uh, tend to grow a lot, um, what do you call it, longer hairs, you know, like unruly and stuff like that. Those hairs, I would just comb straight up and just um, with baby scissors slightly uh, uh, cut that with the baby scissors you don't, uh, you know, in a couple of 
you don't want to take one long stroke, you want to do a couple a little at a time like that so that way you get more um, natural to it instead of one hard straight line. Um, use baby scissors so that way you can just slightly go in there. Um, but since you see I don't really have long hairs because I always clean them up and stuff like that. Um, but if for the so on the top section here for the masculine eyebrow, whatever um, is out on this edge here, at the outer edge, I would clean up. So I'd probably clean up like this hair here and this couple of hairs, wherever it's outside of the edge. Remember, you don't want to be too clean with it because once again, this is a masculine eyebrow. And I'll probably just leave those, the other hairs that are like slightly right here, there. I'm going to take that one off and then clean up these hairs here and a little bit here. I would, you know, just kind of take the edge off here. I really wouldn't go into the shape. I would just um, slightly clean those up and probably like these couple of hairs here. You can see that's more clean in this section. Um, that's because the hairs haven't grown out completely there. So that's pretty much it here with this I brought um, as far as the masculine shape. Remember this would be your inner point and um, from here from the outer eyebrow you would just go straight across into that section. And so we're just going to tweeze those hairs here. And um, it looks like on this side I really didn't have much hairs that grew up down here on the bottom so it's going to be a lot easier on this one. So I'll get that hair down there. Uh, that's pretty much it for the bottom right there. Uh, now we're going to go ahead and take that on the outside here from like, you know, or I'm sorry, right in here with the, ar the arch would be. We're going to tweeze right in here. This would be about the high point of the uh, masculine eyebrow um, arch. It would probably be about right in there, kind of where mine is at now. Um, we're just going to tweeze out about these two hairs here. Maybe that one too. Because um, remember, we're not trying to shape it. We're trying to stay square-like. So remember, straight, kind of like that. Um, and then whatever's in this arch, naturally we don't want to change the shape. We just kind of want to clean it up. So it looks that's about it. Not too many hairs grew out in this section, so I'm not going to really choose anything out of there. Um, it would probably go something like that, and this would be the arch point. And um, in this section here, yes, it is a little feminine still. Um, <laughs> but um, as far as the mask and eyebrow goes, there would be more hairs in here, like a bunch. Um, but because I tweeze my knot like forever in a day, it's taking a while and I'm not going to let them grow anymore. It's already been three weeks. <laughs> uh, it looks like there's nothing here, so we're just going to tweeze out right in this section. And tweeze those couple of hairs right there. And, um, and then go up to where this point's at. And then we'll just take this point straight across a little bit. Um, so it looks like we're just going to be moving these hairs right here. And um, what else? And that's about it. So we're just going to tweeze these hairs. And uh, it looks like on this side, as far as growing out, um, not too many hairs grew out the way they did here. So, um, oh well, we're just going to have to work with that. <laughs> and once again, if this is a masculine eyebrow, there would be more hairs in this section here, up here too. Um, the way they're missing here, I mean, the way they're missing down here, they're also missing here. So, if, you know, they would grow a little more crazy like. And um, that's pretty much it. And uh, so at this point, then you would just uh, tweeze out, you know, I mean, to use your baby scissors again to trim up on your long hairs. And as far as out here at the outer edges, I wouldn't tweet, uh, cut those. You want those to be longer, um, whether it's masculine or female. It just looks better. Uh, so in here, you would totally want to clean, cut those or trim those if um, those were long. So that's pretty much it. Uh, just remember, think square. You want to take your line straight across, uh, square up, not arched or rounded, and then another straight line across here where the arch would be, just to slightly clean that up. And you really wouldn't take it in an angle here. You would just, whatever long hairs are out of here, you would just tweeze those. If there's any hairs here, you would tweeze those. Oh. So uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching this um, video on how to do guys' eyebrows. Hope you enjoyed.